Hello everyone. Um, the following is going to be a Walmart grocery haul and it is all without me in it, but there will be a voiceover with the prices. So there you go. Please keep watching. Well, first up we have uh, great value breadsticks. These were two bucks. My son loves them. I always make them when we have spaghetti. And I, in particular, eat the garlic bread, which was $1.57. I love it because it's made like on a French bread. I don't know. It's wicked good. And then sometimes I will add uh, mozzarella cheese on top of it. And here we have 32 ounces of strawberries. I love strawberries and I love blueberries. And these were 18 ounces for $3.58 delish and my son's chocolate milk half a gallon is two dollars and 63 cents a half a gallon of skim milk was a dollar 49 celery for multiple uses a dollar 48 and one really big onion for 60 cents i needed it for something and <laughs> two <laughs> bell peppers they were 76 a piece I love how I say I needed them for something. Clearly, I needed all the food for something. So, two packages of salad, and they were $1.48 each. And they didn't have any regular sized cucumbers, so I had to buy these little mini cukes, and they were $2.23. I was annoyed, but they actually, they were pretty good. They tasted pretty good. Not that they, you know, tasted different than a regular cucumber, but whatever. So, I bought two packages of P.F. Chang sesame chicken. They was $6.52 a piece for each. Well, duh, a piece. Good Lord. And two tubs of cookie dough. They were $4.86 each. And for me, some raspberry special K. And that was $3.88. And for my boy, we got some peanut butter Captain Crunch for $2.67. That's his favorite cereal. And about a what is this? Oh, 42 ounces of rice for $3.82. And two packages of taco seasoning, which were 44 cents each. <laughs> My dog. And two cans of diced tomatoes. They were 46 cents a piece. So we have eight ounce grated cheese for $2.36. And the larger 16 ounce right there was $4.68. And two jars of marinara sauce for $1.28 each. Box of rotini, 16 ounces for 82 cents. And a four piece package of Velveeta um, sauce and shells there, $3.98. Some general sow sauce for $2.84. Marshmallow fluff for $2.08. And dragon fruit drink mix for $1.74. And some nacho cheese tortilla chips. What were they? They were $1.23 and the pretzels were $2.98. Some croutons for $0.92. Cents. And some tortilla strips to go with salads and the croutons or whatnot um for a dollar 98 and some crusty blueberry muffins they were two dollars and 14 cents and you'll see that i'm about to show you the betty crocker blueberry mix and that was two dollars and 18 cents and i was deliberately making both packages to see which blueberry mix uh tasted better and uh betty crocker won and their uh, crisco oil for dollar 94 some white popcorn for $4.98. I just prefer white. It's my favorite. So there you go. And everyone's favorite bread. The Sourdough Italiano by Fryhoffers. And it was $2.58. I don't always buy this because of the price. But I splurged. And some flour tortillas from Mission. They were $4.26. And to be honest, we use those to make peanut butter fluff sandwiches in the tortilla. And it's absolutely fabulous. And some Dawn dish soap for $2.64. And some shampoo and stuff for my son, $2.94. And on to the dog treats. This is the big bag, 24 ounce. 
It's $15.36. It's freaking expensive, but my dog loves them. And I bought her some milk bone. They're brushing chews. They were $3.46. Some bagging strips for $2.84. Some pepperoni for $2.93. And some milk bone, little, little tiny bones for $2.93. She doesn't get these all the time. I mean, this is just every day she gets a different kind of tree. That's all. These Caesar soft chews are for uh, the doggies where I clean their house on Wednesdays. It's for them, for them, for the little poodles. And the Mott's apple juice is $4.46. And all these little uh, clear American uh, calorie-less, fat-less, carb-less, they have nothing in them. They are my drinks. They are 57 cents each and they, are, and they have a five cents bottle deposit. And uh, I was just looking for a variety of flavors, but I will tell you the mandarin orange is my absolute favorite. And, you'll, and I bought, I don't even know, probably like 10 bottles of the mandarin orange. They are awesome. Love them. So there you go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a fabulous day. Please come back and see me if you enjoyed the haul and enjoy listening to my dog. Please subscribe. Come back and see me. Didn't I just say that? I probably did. I'm tired. Uh, leave me a like, a comment, and I'll see you soon.